I'm Jodie Law with the latest news. First this evening, children as young as 11 are being groomed into violent drug gangs at school. That's according to a Derby charity that's supporting worried parents. Three women have told us how their families were torn apart after they discovered drugs and weapons at home. Our social affairs correspondent Jeremy Ball reports. Next, more reviews are to be carried out into how the authorities responded to the Nottingham attacks last summer. Last week, Valdo Calicane was given an indefinite hospital order for killing Barnaby Webber, Grace O'Malley Kumar and Ian Coates. But the victims' families have said they're unhappy with the sentence and how the authorities handled the case. Well, our reporter, Victoria Hicks, joins us now. What are these new reviews? And how are the victims' families reacted to all of this? A major incident has been declared in two Leicestershire villages after two, up to 2,000 homes were left without gas. Nottingham's home birth service has been suspended while a review into its carried out into its future. An adventure playground in Leicester that was co-founded by the Adrian Mole author Sue Townsend has been badly damaged in a suspected arson attack. Now it's time for the weather. Here's Jill with Hello. the forecast. Good evening. Roger as well. Thank you, Jill. Well, that's all from the late team. I hope you enjoy what's left of your evening. Take care for now. Bye-bye.